Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to use the QSM leaderboards add-on. And you can use this service called InstaWP to quickly launch your own disposable WordPress environment. This service has amazing features, so go ahead and check out their website at instawp.io. Okay, so from your WordPress dashboard, click QSM on the left. And if you have not installed Quiz and Survey Master, there is a link on the screen and in the description to a video that shows you how to get started. Once you're on this page, click Extend QSM with Pro Add-ons. So on this page, there are three different pricing plans that you can select to purchase add-ons as a pack. But if you scroll down, you can find individual add-ons that you can purchase. So all you need to do is find the leaderboards add-on. It's on the right side of the page. Click it. Then click add to cart. Okay, so from this page, all you need to do is follow the checkout process by entering your payment information. Once you're done, you will receive your license key as well as a link to download the add-on. Once you have downloaded your leaderboards add-on, it's now time to set it up. Hover over Plugins on the left, then click Add New. Once you're on this page, click Upload Plugin. So here, you can either click Choose File to browse the file from your computer, or you can simply drag the file from your download location over to the Upload box. So just drag it and drop it right here. Once you're done, click Install Now. Once the installation is done, click Activate Plugin. Okay, so once the activation is complete, it's now time to install your license key. So hover over QSM, then click Add on Settings. Okay, so on this page, we need to find the leaderboard settings. So on the right, on the same line, click Settings. Enter your add on license key in this box, then click Save Changes. Next, we want to go over to Quizzes or Surveys. So in the QSM menu on the left, click Quizzes or Surveys. So this is where you select the quiz or survey you want to configure the leaderboards for. Um, so I'm going to select General Questions. So this is a survey with about six questions. To configure the leaderboard settings, click the Leaderboards tab over at the top. Okay, so here we have some variables. So if we look in the bottom left, we should see um, under leaderboard template allowed variables. So these variables are the ones that we can use to customize our leaderboards. So at the top, we have the variable as well as its corresponding um, description. So basically each variable has its description right next to it in this section here. So let's add our leaderboard content. So let's type leaderboard. Let's choose a variable. So um, let's choose quiz name. So we're going to type four. Um, then we're going to copy this quiz name variable. So simply highlight, then copy and paste. So we have leaderboard for quiz name. Let's make this bold. Also, let's add a period at the end of this line. OK. And let's say um, congratulations or congrats to all of the uh, all of the high scores, high scores. Okay. So now we need to add some more variables. Let's use, um, first place underscore name. We're going to use this. So copy highlight to copy, and we just want to paste it under the first line. Okay. Let's also take, um, the second part. So first place score, let's copy with the hyphen and simply paste it next to first place name. So we will have the name of the quiz taker as well as the score. So now we need to do the same for second as well as third place. I'm going to speed up this part of the video. So you can always add more positions to your leaderboard, but I'm just going to leave first, second and third place. Once you're done, click save changes. Okay, so now we need to add this leaderboard to a page. So over at the top, we have this short code right here. Um, all we need to do is highlight this to copy and paste it into the short code field for our page. Let's create a new page. 
we're going to call this quiz uh, quiz leaderboard. At the bottom, let's add a new block and search for short code. Click short code once you found it and paste your short code right here. So we can either publish this, but let's preview it. Preview in a new tab. Okay, so here we have our quiz leaderboard. It says leaderboard for general questions. Congrats to all the high scores. And at the bottom, we have all of the high scores. So we have Chester and Marie, both with 100% and tutorials. So basically tutorials is the name of this user. So um, if you add more positions, then they would also be displayed on this page. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching. If this video was helpful to you, don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe or share this video with a friend who would need it. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching and see you in the next one.